everybody and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World Alive! Why? On a Monday? Well, today, um, I've been having good luck with the, the my regular PvPs. We also have some new things to have a look at because there was a secret um, oh, dinosaur, this, well, creature that was added to the game that not many people knew about. Uh, also, we are launching HD 60 Pro, um, well, basically got a new iPad. Now we can play pretty much every game at like 60 FPS, including Jurassic World Alive. Um, because the iPad I've been playing on this whole time was like seven years old or something like that. So it was, it was a really old iPad, which I mean, it did its job. It did great. But I mean, look at that. Look, look how quick that loaded. It was like, done. Yeah, there you go. I can go into here. And oh, look at that. Look how quick that is. And click on the dinosaur. Okay, maybe it takes a little bit longer. This is my team! And I was actually really tempted to go for the deer, like to max the deer to level 30. And I know what you're thinking, beavers. Why? Why do it? It's a waste. You've got a new hybrid. Which I say, oh, who cares? <laughs> I mean, what? Does the bear have anything better than the deer? It probably does. Okay, it probably does. There's gonna be people out there who are MLG pros. Who are gonna be like, yeah, beavers, the, the bear's just like way better. You should definitely just get the bear. Don't get the deer. But say that though. Oh. I'm not looking back. We're going for the level 30 freaking deer. There we go. And because now it's level 30, we can put another boost on it. Um, do I wanna put now I don't know what makes a difference. Do we want more health or do we want more attack? Also, there's a lot of things we need to talk about. Tokens, the reset tokens are a thing as well. Um, and you can only hold, I think, one of each type, and then the rest gets stored in your mail, and then they get deleted after a certain period of time. Um, and if we look at um, our... So this is the tournament that's just coming to an end, and this is the end of it, I think. Once this finishes, Alliance Championship ends in five hours. So in six hours, we, we are getting our tier nine reward. So I just want to give a big round of applause, everybody, and the Beaver Pals Alliance. The level below it is 250 into Taurus DNA. This level is 400 into Taurus DNA. And what thing's higher? It's just 500. So you go from a difference between 150 to 100. And before that, it's just 50. So you go, so you go 150, 200, 250, and then this one, 400, and then that one's like, eh, 500. So really, there's, I, I kind of like that. I kind of like that Ludia decided to, to not give the best alliance, you know, even if you get the highest reward, the reward from the second best incubator is like, it's not too much of a difference. This one is a big difference. So if you get this one, it's like, you, d you did great. Um, so yes, I want to give a big shout out to everyone who uh, helped out there, except for the bottom ones. Screw you. <laughs> you'll be booted, you'll be dead. Uh, so we're, of course, we're, we, you know, we're clopping clop along with this, uh, slowly grinding those out. Here it is, Alaractus. The panda. Was it actually a panda? I don't know. Yes. So, what does it have? Ferocious shield, shielded heal. Alert, <laughs> decelerating, oh God. Believe that. Uh, fierce rampage is dropping healing, can't heal. So, although it is an extinct use of panda. Oh, it is. Oh, right, okay. This creature lived in China in the late Miocene, around 8 million years ago. Well, there, that, that's me told. Okay, right. What I'm here for is my level 30 team. Uh, now, the only things I'm maybe wanting to switch out is probably Hadrosaur looks for something. What I was really wanting is like a ref referantum or the Hydra Boa. So we could get a... Right, can we? No. Also the booster at the top now. Where the boosts go? Oh, there they are up there. So we have loads of attack boosts if I want to put that on something. So ref is really good because it has that priority like attack. So I am pretty happy with the team I've got. Um, this, my Gorga, Gorga Trebex is almost fully maxed. So I just need four more speed boosts to get it to the point where I'm at. Because I faced up against this one, uh, in, in one of the battles and I was like, that was like really good. So I just, I went on their stats, screenshotted it and just went like, yeah, I'm going to make my own now. <laughs> I, I think a lot of people don't have anything wrong with boosts per se. The added customization that allows you to, you know, give, or, or gives you. Um, and allows you to customize your team is great. Uh, but the way they're handing it out isn't good. Um, the way that, you know, the boosts are really hard to come by. Uh, maybe they're a little bit easier now, especially with the boosted uh, incubators that are on the map. So I'm assuming it's one of each because there's only like three types of boosts. Um, 
So you have to wait an entire- If you want to reset a creature, you could do one creature per month. Per month? Are you kidding me? That like, ugh. I mean, yeah, I guess, but it, it needs to be quicker. It needs to be quicker than that. Especially for like, again, I don't want to say like the rich get richer sort of thing, but maybe higher like incubator ranks get more of them. Then therefore there's more incentive for people to do that because at the moment, you know, we've had boost in the game for so long that I have a Mortem Rex that I've taken all the boosts off, I think. I've taken all the all the speed off. I think its speed is... Oh no, its speed's still 16. I've taken all the attack off, but I haven't taken the speed and I haven't taken the health. There's only four. It's like, I don't want to waste a whole token only taking four off. I've also got a Sinusar or Sarah Magnus that has 19 attack boosts and 11 health boosts on it. I've got... I think I've got other... I think like... Yeah, this guy. Uh, I've got 10 health boosts on that. Six health boosts on that, and 14 speed boosts on it. So I've got, I think maybe I did take some boosts off some creatures, because I was like, oh, I don't know how long this is going to last for, and I want to use these boosts. I want to be able to play the game the way it wants me to, which is put boosts on everything. I know this game heavily relies on you paying for incubators. It really does. It doesn't hide it. It knows that you're, it wants you. It's completely self-aware that it wants you to spend as much money, real money, as, as you can, to buy incubators to get like boosts, uh, sanctuary helps, things, and you know, DNA. I mean, I look at this. You got 13, 17, 17, 8, 8, and a thousand. So they know, they know for a fact. They 100% know for a fact that they, 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 that they were aware. They're aware of what they want to do. And it's, it's just frustrating for basically a hundred quid, probably over a hundred dollars, if not more. Um, you only get like two boosts for attack and health and then one boost for speed. Dino Bash, that's the one. When I played Dino Bash, I was so happy at that, that game's ending. Because it was basically, oh, you've played the whole game. You put all the effort in here. Here's, here's everything basically for free. Give it a shot. And it was just so nice to actually have a mobile game do the reverse of what this model is, which is, you want to play the game? Probably going to have to fork over money. Sorry. Because th there is no way. Because the way this is, you can go on the leaderboards, you can see who's top. The these people, they they have the best dinosaurs, as you can see. Hydro and Referantum are only level 29 because you can only get that DNA in raids. However, the Ankyl Ankylosaurus looks that you can see there, and the bear... Or DNA that you could, you you know, you can buy or, or dart and stuff. They're already maxed. So these guys, they finish top level. They get the best rewards. Um, obviously, they'll get the best alliance rewards. It's it's just like the top get richer and richer and richer. And it's like, oh, sweet. And if you want... <laughs> I know, I feel like I'm picking on the top players who play them. I'm saying, and fair play to them. There's nothing wrong with what they do. Because that's the way the game is. But it just means that people who maybe don't have the time or don't play the game as much just get penalized for not playing it as much or not spending the most money on it, which sucks. It really does. Um, but Toshi, I've never seen Toshi up top. Wow. Level 30. Oh, wow. What a level. He even got lucky with the Hydro Bone Referantum. Jesus. Out of the, to the two top players in the entire world, I have two of the dinosaurs. Ha. Interesting. But it's good that it actually shows you the boosts and what they've put on them. I don't care. I want to play the game. I want to play the game. I mean, does everybody just got these same creatures? Oh, this one's got this one. Oh, interesting. <laughs> but they are showing their Gorgotrebex, which has max attack. Gee, all attack and all speed. Wow. Okay, fair dues. Right. But the thing is, let's say, you know, I, I see that and I want to be able to, you know, change my Gorgotrebex to that. I'm like, actually, no, that's a better build. What? I have to wait a month and then use all of the stuff I get in a month to reset it and then shift them around? No! And I, I feel like if you've put boosts on a dinosaur, I should be able to move them. I don't need to be penalized for taking any off. I could I surely I could shuffle them around. Anyway, anyway, what I wanted to do is actually play some games because I'm actually having loads of fun playing this at the moment. Nah, we're definitely not doing that. But I, you know, we might as well try some matches and just see how this goes because I do have a max level. Um, like Spino Constrictor, and I don't know whether I showed that off in the last video. 
Um, I think it's mainly health just because it seems like it's a counter. So as long as I stay alive longer, then I can, you know, get a counter off and do better that way. You could say, well, actually just go for the precise rampage and just boost up all that. But 11? Uh, yeah, I'm happy with that, and I don't need speed. I'm okay with fast speed. Uh, but anyway, uh, how about we just go ahead and do some battles? All right, here we go. Arena 12, Jairus for Depot. Defeat three creatures. Oh, okay. That's, um, is, is it okay? I would have preferred. You know what it is? I should have a team where no matter what I get, I'm like, okay, I can work with this. It never does. Maybe that's why I never get higher than Gyrosphere at the moment. But hey ho, let's give this a shot. Indutorus may be a good one to start with. Oh ho ho ho! Ooh, is it though? Now, what are the chances he's gonna start with Resilient Strike, right? Like, what are the chances he's gonna start? If he goes for Rampage, am I immune to weakness? Kind of. Eh, sort of. I've got enough health. Let's just go for that. Let's make him weak. I'm. I think he may even go for Resilient. I think he might. I think he might. Just predicting my cloak. Let's see. Did he big brain play? He did try to big brain play, but he got big brain played himself. Oh my good god. Right, okay. So if this is the case, I could probably just go for like, mm, I don't know. Is it is it really good? Uh, you know, I'll just swap. I'll swap. I, I The ball is in my court. And yes, I guess I could safely go for a cleanse maybe i should have maybe i should have maybe i should have went for a cleanse but I i'm happy taking that i've got enough health to a point where i could have intertorus swap in and go for a cloak and survive and get a good counter off ah yes okay we have a problem okay that's fine raw 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 oh and it's a crit as well oh maybe that's not so good but we do remove the attack increase as well so this isn't so bad uh, Modelo Rhino is actually survived. What I could do now is go for, like, another attack reduction, or I could go for a big hit. Uh, I'm just gonna go for attack reduction. The thing is, what's gonna happen here is he's prob- Oh, he can't do anything. That's right. Oh, dear. Uh, what's the cooldown on Raw? It's probably- Oh, it's two! Oh, no! Oh, that was terrible! Maybe that was a terrible idea on him. I was actually thinking that I've lost Modelo Rhino, but, uh, yeah, um, oh, oh, we go straight through the cloak. I think we remove it, do we? Maybe, we might remove the cloak. I think, I think we do. Um, but we won't hit for 3,000, probably like 2,000 and not damage. Um, but at least we get rid of the cloak, which is great. So yes, purpose, 2,200. Um, now, now what do we do? Uh, we could just swap in our own. He's probably just gonna go for a regular hit. Does he have enough attack? He has enough attack to kill me. So he's probably just going to go for a regular bite and just get through my armor. I think that's what he's going to do. But I want the speed boost and the cloak. I mean, if he was careful, he might have thought ahead. I mean, this guy is obviously thinking one step ahead. So he might have just went for the uh, the bleed and the stun, I think. Uh, no, he didn't. Oh, okay. Okay. I think we're maybe getting lucky here. All right. All right. This is really good because we got two. We're two nil. It doesn't matter what he does here. Um, oh, is, oh, is he giving up? Oh, oh, oh is he? Get, yep, 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 yep. Okay, okay. The guy's giving up. Guy gave up. He rage quit. He rage quit after throwing his Morden Rex away. He was like, ah! <laughs> he just completely gave up. Bless him. Oh, you hate to see it, but hey ho. At least we got an easy win. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, he hasn't. Oh, never mind. I thought he had. He's going to go for the... Probably the... Like... What do you call it? The instant rampage damage reduction. But uh, I'd, I'd rather... I mean, I'm, I'm faster anyway, so I may as well. Um, are we going to 3 nil? We're not going to 3 nil. We can't 3 nil. It's a boss. All right. Okay. So... Uh... I don't want to have three nil. We may as well give him one. May as well give him one. Even if I swapped out now, I think... I think I maybe. be... There's a, there's a good chance I could get out. I don't know what resistance is for the swap. 50%. Okay, there's a chance I could have got out. Uh, okay. Okay, he's probably faster now, I think. Um, no, he's not. Oh. Oh, is he just giving up? 
Oh, he hasn't given up. He's going for the sidestep. Ah, oh, good on him. Right, okay. Um, so, well, there you have it. He's, he's definitely survived. Almost 3-0. Thank God I didn't know. Because that's soul crushing when you do that. Um, so, I mean, if I swapped... Right, does that mean that he gets to do his attack? Uh, and then I still... Maybe. Maybe if he hadn't, like, swap reduced me there, then I would have been able to actually... Like, if he hadn't locked me in, I could have got Model Rhino out. Um... I mean, what's his attack? 5,000? Uh, there's a good chance he's going to get a crit as well. Well, it doesn't matter what he does. We'll just make sure he dies. He's probably actually going to go for the... Um, yeah, well, like, if I went for Cloak, he, he's going to go for superiority and he's going to kill me, actually. So, what I'm going to do... Oh, okay, okay. I was just going to make sure that when I swap out, he hits me and I hit him back and then I kill him. But actually, he's, he's just died anyway. So, well, well, GG, GG. I thought he'd rage quit. Maybe, maybe he did and then he decided to come back to it. Or maybe he lost connection. But then I guess if he did lose connection, it would have, it would have showed. Um, so actually, I think he's killed me here. Oh, I cannot lose. Can I? Oh my God. Oh my God. I think I've lost. Well played. Does he think it's over? You cocky booger. You think it's, you think it's over? It isn't. Oh, well, it might be, depending if I get the cloak on. <laughs> if, if he gets a crit, yeah, I think I'm dead no matter what. Oh, we won. Wow, it was almost. Yeah, you too. Uh, good luck. No, ah, I didn't even get to say good luck. Wow, that was close. That was way closer than it needed to be. Oh, oh, that was, that was too close. No, no more of that. Tape, that's it. Yeah, yeah, tape will do. Yeah, well done, well done. Um, tape will definitely get that out. Uh, whew. okay, what's next? Fireplace? Uh, let's do fireplace. Um, dynamite. Oh, no, no, dynamite would have- Oh, that would have done it. Oh, no, he's dead! Okay, another battle. Will we make it close or will we lose? I don't know. Let's, uh, let's start with the Taurus again. Also, after thinking about the whole boost situation, like, that definitely could be handled better. But the, it, it's always nice to have something to, to like, aim towards. I always think that's a good thing. Um, but at the same time, it's like, oh, come on, man. Like, there is a big discrepancy between the top-level players and mid-level players. There's a huge one. Um, eh, yeah, may as well do this. Oh, he went for the distracting. Oh, my God, and he got the crit. He's basically dead. Okay. Maybe, maybe probably should have went for the cloak. I could have survived that, I suppose. Um, how fast is it? 129. Oh my god, it's got 3,000 and odd attack. Wow. Um, yeah. Uh, I, I, I mean, may as well. I mean, we reduce his attack. Uh, we get the cloak. Because he's going to hit me with how much? Almost 7,000 damage. Even if it goes through my cloak, he's, uh, he's not going to kill me. Um, but he will go for that. Oh, we did. Oh. Oh. Why do? Oh, did he? I just got big brain played there. Oh my god! Yeah, I think I'm dead no matter what here. I don't cleanse my. Yeah, wow. Oh, oh, Tenado saw. Yeah, he went for it again. <laughs> well played. Well played. Wow, that was awful. That was horrendous. Um, yeah, like I'm. I've lost. I've lost because of that. Like, what a play there. What an absolute play. Uh, oh, if he, if he got a crit there, he would have killed me as well. Jesus. That was redonkulous. Wow. Oh, like, the thing is, I never find Tenotosaurus much of a threat. Uh, okay, now you're going to go for your, uh, your thingy, aren't you? Um, yeah, I may as well just call this one quits. At this point, at this point, there's nothing I can do. Um... Like, he's pretty much killed me. Um, yeah, yeah, there's nothing I can do here. That was all because of, like, two moves that Tenotosaurus did and I did wrong. And that cost me the entire game. Because now, he's just going to do 8,000 damage onto me and just kill me. So, well well played, uh, I think. Yes, well, yeah, just, just get it over with. Oh my god, that was absolutely nuts! 
Jesus! That's probably the fastest game ever <laughs> I've ever had. Wow! Unless you're like top tier, highest level in the game, you f you feel like, well, if I max that with what limited resources I have, they're just gonna nerf it. And then I can't, and then it's wasted. And then I've gotta wait 10 months until I can take boosts off it. Ludia! Get your act together, god damn it. Okay. All right, this last one. I promise, last one. And it's, uh, I guess it's okay. You know, we're gonna start with, with the Spino Constrictor. Let's get some passive bleed up. I don't think many things open that have resistance to bleed. Apart from Morton. Oh, this thing, 100% not. No, that's good. Okay, let's go. Let's go then. Let's do two bleeds to you. You definitely can't kill me with with one hit. At, ooh, 4,740 though. I, uh, I am immune to it. Oh, that's good. Oh, he didn't get the crit. No, that's just not fair. Bah! <laughs> okay, it should be dead. It should be dead at this point, I think. And oh, it's not dead. Why is it not dead? Um, I mean, he could go for a cleanse, I think. I mean, he's dead. I, we have to just go for for this, just in case he goes for the sidestep. Um, oh, he does go for the sidestep. Oh, well, bless him. He tried. Like, that was my safest bet. What, what, I go for instant distraction and hope he attacks me? Nah, I, I just had to do this one. Unfortunately, I think that means I've used my best attacks. So, really, I don't even think... Oh, does my cloak still hang on? Oh, it must do for two turns. Oh, okay. Maybe that's because he did his thing first. He did his uh, sidestep. That's why I still have this, possibly. Um, so he is quicker. Uh, with that in mind, um, what's what's best here? Do I really want to fodder off my boa constrictor? I don't know if I do. Like, the next turn, I mean, at least we do... Oh, he's immune to it. Okay. <laughs> Forget about that. I was like, he's either resistant to it or immune. He's, he's, he's immune. Okay, so we've narrowed down his attack. So it's a 2,200, which is just enough to kill me but i'm gonna go for this expecting him to go for his big hit now yes ha 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 uh, i think he's still gonna kill me next turn <laughs> yes he is okay well with that in mind let, let's he's probably gonna reduce critical chance and reduce I th oh he'll go for a shield hopefully he goes for a shield actually um, just, you know, prepping himself for whatever comes in next. I think that's probably the safest bet he could go for. Um, now that I'm completely, you know, out of anything to reduce his attack. So I think he's gonna go for a shield. If I was him, I would went for a shield. Oh, he didn't think! Maybe he didn't think about it. Uh, okay. Because then he, like, I could have switched in something that was really quick and just gone for a big attack on him. But, uh, oh, sure, yeah, okay. Um, what, what do we go for here? Uh, da -da 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 -da. Um, like 3,500. Yeah, we'll just do the max attack. We'll just do the max attack we can. Um, I mean, he's not going to be stunned. He's not going to be bled. Oh, is there a chance that he could be stunned? Yeah, no. Then why didn't it show up as immune to stun? Maybe it wouldn't have even stunned him anyway. Okay, so we'll go for his reduced attack now. So he can't kill me in one more hit, which is great because he's going to do 2,200. Which then leaves me alive. And if I had a crit there... Oh! Oh, it would have killed him. Why can't I get the crits? 10% chance. Oh, okay. Never mind. Maybe I didn't even have a chance. Maybe I wasn't even in with a chance. Uh, okay. Okay. So, what do we expect him to do? Like, what's better at this point? I think Boa Constrictor could probably be foddered off. I'm going to fodder off... Uh, sorry, Spino Constrictor. That's it. I'm going to fodder this guy off because I think... Spy, like, Scorpius Rex might be in with a chance of switching in, getting the cloak off, reducing their attack, and then doing some damage. With Spino Constrict at this point is, is wasted. So I think that was the biggest attack. Um, I'm just going to put in the deer. I'm going to put in the deer. This is going to be a close one. It really depends on what he's got. Woo! Just go for that. Just go for that. I didn't realize I was going to be the same speed as him. And even if it reduces my attack and has a cloak... I'm gonna be able to do damage to it. Oh, right. Okay, okay. I'm actually quicker than it. Yes. Okay, this is a, this is terrible. Entoros should be faster than me, um, but it's not. Okay. Oh, that's a big, that's a big hit. Right. So basically, we've killed it. Doesn't matter what it does. 
even if it goes for a regular hit or a cloak, whichever one it chooses, um, I'm going to be able to kill it next turn. Yeah, going to be able to kill it. Because I've got my Devastation ready. So that's unfortunate. He may even switch out. Um, I, he's going to take a loss. If he switches out, I'm going to get healed and I'm going to do a big hit. It's not looking too good for him. Nah, no, he's just he's been sodded, man. <laughs> sodded. Maybe he was hoping that I wouldn't, and maybe I wouldn't have if I didn't have the vulnerability there. So not so bad, not so bad. Even if I had went for the other attack, though, the reducing his attack and cleansing me, I still would have had enough to kill him without, you know, because that would have done more damage. Oh, oh God, is he just giving up at this point? Is, is, is this just a, is this a throw in the, the towel that Sarah Magnus just... Just chucked out there without, you know, doing any damage straight away. Um, yeah, I think, I think, I think this might be, this might be good night. Um, he's probably gonna go go for the speed. Uh, no, no, he is completely thrown in the towel. Okay. <laughs> yeah, what? I mean, all right. He even gets the crit. Okay. Fair, fair dues, fair dues. Um, there's nothing I can swap in. Oh, oh. Yeah, is he just gonna, is he just, yeah, he's just, <laughs> he's just, not a great way to end the video, but yeah, baby, there it is, there it is, we, we won one, we, we won two, um, I think we lost two or three, I can't remember, but there it is, that is Jurassic World Alive in a nutshell. You spend an hour and get nowhere. Well done, you. Well done. But if you enjoyed this video, guys, leave a like. I'm kind of enjoying the game at the moment. Um, but I think it, it definitely could still be fixed with those resets. Because, I don't know. I mean, it's hard enough just collecting DNA. Why make it even harder for the boosts? I mean, come on. Anyway, but if you enjoyed this video, guys, leave a like. Until next time, I'll see you later. Oh, bye-bye. <laughs>